guys, over the next couple of days together, we are gonna go Christmas shopping. I'm kind of looking for some new Christmas decor and I'm really excited to see what everyone has this year. I'm going in with no expectations and hopefully we find some good stuff. Also, to be completely transparent with you guys, I'm actually filming this in November because I feel like if I was to film this in December, all of the Christmas goodies would be out of stock. They would sell out and there would be nothing for us to shop for. So that's why I have pre-filmed this for you guys. So that way we can get in while everywhere still has stock. The plan for today's agenda is to go to TK Maxx. I do have two TK Maxx's close by. So if we get time, we'll go to the second TK Maxx. I saw this really nice wreath from Bed Bath & Table. So I wanna go in there to see if they have it in stock. So what do you guys say? Let's go Christmas shopping. <laughs> Okay, so straight away, there was a trolley here with all these really cute mugs. I love this one with the little skiers in between the trees. And then look at this one. It's like a mug set. Oh, that is so cool. Love that. They have a heap of different like bakeware. How nice is this one here with the pink? Little gingerbread houses on it, so cute. I also really love this gingerbread man bowl. That's so cute for like Christmas cookies and stuff. I love this one with the little handle on it as well. And I love the snowflake pattern. These measuring jugs, get out of here. How nice is that? This one is $12.99, so 13 bucks. Oh, I love that. <laughs> This would be a really good gift idea for those who love their body care or skin care. They have this like body scrub, bath crystals with this cute little scoop. I love these. What a great little gift idea. It's sealed. I guess we'll never know what it smells like. Okay, I think this might be the garland I get. I love the little white berries through it. Definitely gonna grab this one. This would be really nice for like your table centerpiece. It's nice and long, so I feel like this would look really good. The only thing I would do is maybe spray a bit of like fake snow or something on it to give it that snow look, but that's really nice. I'm obsessed with these mini arrangements. They are so cute. Oh, how nice is that? I also really love these and this one has gold all through it. They're really nice as well Okay, how nice is this wreath? So beautiful. I think it's just a little bit too large for my front door though They have a bunch of Christmas throws on this rack. They have this one here with oh, it's stuck this one here with the pink snowflakes, that's really nice. This one has some slight red detail, that's quite nice as well. There's this one with all the different Christmas trees. I love the green in this and it's so soft as well. I wish you guys could feel that, it's so soft. There's an ugly sweater one here. I'm not into like bright reds or traditional Christmas colors, but how nice is that throw? And once again, so soft. I'm loving the greens and the cream color in this. I think that one's really nice as well. And then lastly, there's this one here. I love the light gray with the pop of red with the Santa hats. Okay guys, if you're into the gingerbread theme, you're gonna want this on your couch. How cute is that? Can we just take a moment for how cute this is? Oh my gosh. They have some cute Santas as well. How cute is this one with all the little puppies on it? They have lots of different options for cushions. I love it. There's this one here with the gold it has like little bells on it too that's quite nice now they're all gonna fall off because i touched it i really like this snowflake one it's like tufted is that what you call it it has some silver detail through it and it's just really soft I think I'll pick up two of these for my couch. Look at these giant ornament pillows. Over in America at Home Goods, I think they have like this boucle ornament pillow. And I really want something similar, but these are massive. These are like 50 centimeters round. They are huge. All the Christmas stockings. Let me show you some of my favorites. I love this gray knitted set. It's also really soft and pretty thick as well. Like I don't think you could see through it, which is quite nice. This one is 
is $40 for the two, which is quite expensive in my opinion for a stocking, but still really nice quality. There's also these knitted ones in a cream color. These ones are slightly cheaper, $30 for the two, and they're also a really nice option. I don't know if you guys can see that, but these ones have like a checkered, a very subtle checkered pattern. These are really nice. I love the fur, so soft. I just found the cream colorway for the gray stockings, so nice. I definitely prefer the cream, especially because my walls are gray, so I feel like this is gonna blend in a bit too much. Now it's all about deciding between this set or this set. This one's a bit more expensive than this one. This one's a little bit more creamy yellow, and I think I like the color of this a little bit better. Look at this ornament. It's ramen, that's so funny. These are so beautiful. They've got little glass trees on the inside. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys, these are so heavy. What are these made out of? My goodness. I don't know if you guys can see that, but this is a giant gingerbread style Christmas tree. I am obsessed with that, so nice. It is $40, a little bit more expensive, but still so worth it. It looks beautiful. candle section is my kryptonite, I swear. This candle is nice, but can we take a moment for the baby Santa on top? How cute is that? He's so cute. They have these sparkling wine candles. This would be a great stocking stuffer for anyone in your family who loves wine. I'm not a fan of that one either. How cute is this candle here. It has like the little Christmas trees on top. This is quite similar to the TikTok one that went viral recently. $12.99 is the price. You guys, look at this. It's like a little hot chocolate. It smells kind of like mint chocolate. Oh, it literally says right here. Peppermint hot chocolate. And that's exactly how it smells. What other ones do they have here? They have this one, gingerbread mocha latte. Ooh, that one's quite nice. I'm obsessed with this oven mitt set. It has like hot cocoa and marshmallows on this pot holder. And then it has, one second, it has this tea towel. Like hot cocoa and marshmallows, so cute. 20 bucks for a set of three things, I think. Yeah, there's an oven mitt as well. Obsessed with this. Love these trifle bowls. There was a clear one on a trolley earlier, but they have this red one here and a green one as well. And they're all made from like a glass, so really good quality. I'm really loving this table runner. It's got the little Christmas trees on there. And then little tassels on the end. Definitely more my style for our table. Okay, let's leave before we buy anything else. Okay, I'm back in my car. I just finished at TK Maxx. I had some really nice Christmas decor in there. I'm not gonna lie, it was really hard to control myself. On our entertainment unit, I really wanna do like a Christmas village theme. So I got a couple of houses and some other bits and pieces, but I'm thinking I will do a separate video of like a haul of all the new Christmas decor I got this year. So I might do that after I finish shopping in like a couple days time. Anyway, the next shop we're gonna go is Bed Bath & Table to see if they have the wreath I really want. There is a plane going overhead at the moment. 
So whenever I film in public, I always get this like anxiety about like, oh, what are they thinking of me? And you know, it's just like an insecurity thing filming in public. But it was even worse today and filming took a little bit longer because the other day I went shopping and I was filming it for my TikTok and I had this old man like follow me around and laugh at me every time I filmed. And now it has made me really insecure filming in public. So because TK Maxx is kind of bigger, it wasn't too bad. But when I go into these next couple stores, I might just show you all the bits and pieces and then we'll do a haul. Look at this plane flying over head. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's like a jet. Anyway, story time's over. Let's go to bed, bath and table. So I just finished at Bed Bath & Table and unfortunately they didn't have the wreath I really wanted. It's clearly a popular one because it says online it's almost sold out. But I was hoping in store they would still have them. However, I love some of their decor pieces this year, especially the houses. I think I have like a Christmas house slash village obsession this year. But they had some really nice Christmas trees, some really beautiful like gold, copper, rose gold colored ornaments. They were really, really nice. And overall just really luxurious looking Christmas decorations. Okay, let's see what the second TK Maxx has to offer. They have some really cute mug sets. I love this one here. And then they have this like mug stack with a little holder. These are so nice. Okay, I love these kitchen towels going in my basket. So for Halloween, I was really disappointed because there were no really nice stems, but I love these. It's going in my basket. These would look so nice on the front patio. I love these two on the ends. There are some really nice tree skirts here. I love this knitted one. I love this checkered one. That's so nice. I just wish this was like white and black as opposed to cream and black. I also really like this throw. What are we looking at here? Where's the price on this? Ah, oh, here. It is $25. I love that. This one here, so cute. And once you like burn all the wax, you could definitely reuse this. You know how I said I really love the checkered look before? Well, check out this wrapping paper. This is right up my alley. I love it. Okay, I just came across these kitchen towels as well, and I love them just as much as the ones before. So now I need your help in deciding. Do I go these ones or these ones? Which one do you think? This one's a lot softer than this one here, but I think I like this print better. Oh man. Okay, it's been like a few minutes now of me just standing here trying to decide, and I think we're gonna go with these ones instead. Love the print. How cute would this sign be if you made like a little hot cocoa bar, hot chocolate bar? You could put this little sign, it comes in green and red. Oh, and it's $10. How cute would that be on like a little stand with all of your different like hot chocolates, all your toppings. Oh, I love it, so cute. Okay guys, I am back in my car now and I would say the TK Maxx shops for today were pretty successful. However, there is always tomorrow. I really want to go to Big W tomorrow, Kmart and a few other shops. But anyway guys, that is a wrap for today's vlog. Thank you so much for shopping with me today and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys tomorrow for some more shopping.